Starting out the game, being physical, knowing that this is a team that thrives off uh, being able to pass the ball, get into the paint, kickouts. We wanted to alleviate some of their abilities to be able to just navigate the offense. So it started with our physicality, keeping them out of the paint, forcing those guys to take tough shots. I say, you know, I sound redundant, but that's that's our defense. And then finishing possessions uh, is extremely important for us, and, and we did that tonight. A franchise record in May. It yeah. seems like this James Borrego offense is starting to really click. What do you see that's working so well for me on the offense? Well, the guys are buying into what we're asking them to do. We're, we're, we're staying with it. We're trusting it, showing them the pictures. When we, watch, when we watch our film work, we're getting on the floor and we're going over it over and over again and expressing to them how important it is to play with force, play with pace, to continue to share the ball, just make the simple plays over and over again. And I thought uh, B.I. set the tone early in the game for us. 500 now on the road. How important is that to be able to perform away from the Center to where you want to go down the road? It's extremely important. The good teams, the solid teams, the good teams, the great teams, they can go and win on the road. And this, this is a, good, a really good road trip for us. You say showing them the pitchers uh, in the film. What do you mean by that? So the pitchers are... You know, we'll show them what we look like when we're doing it right, when we have our spacing, when we're playing with force, playing fast, advantage, no advantage. And we show them the pictures of what we look like when we don't, when it's kind of jumbled up, we don't know what we're in. And so just kind of having clarity on how we want to play on makes, on misses, after free throws, these different environments, and then getting on the floor and saying, okay, let's work on it. Great night uh, from B.I. And, and, and great to respond from the Charlotte game. He didn't have his best game in Charlotte. Um, I, you know, I know he was a little disappointed in that. So I love to see our guys respond the next night. And, and B.I. was big. He set the tone early for us, shooting open shots. And then when he does that, everything opens up for him. Four wins in a row for you guys since Vegas. How much do you like the way your team has responded since a, you know, after a move like that? Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's a blessing to have a group of guys that care. And we're going to go through highs and lows throughout the course of the season, but these guys care. They care about each other. They care, they care about getting on the floor and putting together their best performance. I go back to that moment. It wasn't our best. We know it. We were all disappointed. We worked extremely hard to put ourselves in that position. But the more important component to this is that the guys have responded, and uh, we want to continue to have that resiliency throughout the course of the season. Yeah, of course, the, the three-pointers jump off the page, but Z had 11 rebounds in the last game. He was hitting the offensive force tonight. You mentioned the word force a couple of times. How much have you seen him kind of just pick up that on the force he's been playing? We're getting better and better, and, and Z is, is a big factor to that. Like you said, he, he's playing with force. We're rebounding the ball on both ends. We can get out and play in the open floor. If the game slows down, it's a, it's a big time luxury to have Z, who we can throw the ball to. Also JV, you know, he settles settles us down offensively and, and we make simple plays from the post. Thank you.